Welcome to this tutorial on using PsycInfo to find empirical research articles. PsycInfo is a library database that provides access to the international literature in psychology and related disciplines. It is one of the most important sources for finding research studies for your coursework. The library website is the starting point for your research. However, if you are off campus, log into your Gateway account first and click on Library and Media Services under Campus Resources to get to the library homepage. You can also directly access the library website at library.stkate.edu. To access the St. Kate's databases from the library homepage, click on Article Databases. Scroll down to PsycInfo under Favorite Databases and click on the link. For this demonstration, you're going to look for empirical peer-reviewed journal articles about the effects of post-traumatic stress disorder on memory. However, before we do any searching, we need to set up our search using the database's limiters. Under the search boxes, click on Limit to Peer-reviewed, go down to the Methodology section, and click the box in front of Empirical Study. Now, what do we put in the search boxes? Again, our topic is the effects of post-traumatic stress disorder on memory. We need to put only the essential concepts of our topic into the search boxes which is post-traumatic stress disorder, memory. Words such as effects are not helpful search terms, and neither is typing an, an entire sentence into a search box. In PsycInfo's advanced search, there are stacked boxes connected by drop-down menus with the words and, or, and not. We're going to connect post-traumatic stress disorder with memory by using the word and. Using AND between unrelated terms narrows our search so that each result contains both terms. In our search, we want every result to have post-traumatic stress disorder and memory in it. Using OR between search terms broadens your search and retrieves records with at least one of the terms. It works well for similar terms or synonyms. For our topic, you could search for post-traumatic stress disorder or PTSD. So let's put our search terms in the box, post-traumatic stress disorder, change it to and, memory. And then we'll click on the green search button. So we got over 1,300 results. We could begin going through these results, but a better strategy is to continue to narrow our search. We can do this by adding more search terms or trying different terms, we can also limit our search by publication date, age group, or population. Let's narrow our search to the last five years, so we'll enter a date range, 2012, ending in 2017, we'll update our search. And I'm interested in this topic as it relates to veterans, so I'm going to add and veterans into my search box. We'll clean on the green search button and let's see what happens. Now we're down to 88 results. You can begin scanning through the titles, see if your results match what you're looking for. To see more information about a citation record, click on the title. The full record will have additional information about the item, including an abstract, which is a brief summary of the article. On the right-hand side of the screen are tools that enable you to cite, email, print, or save. We'll go back to results. And notice under each record, there's either a full text PDF link, which will give you access to the full text of the article, or a Find It button, which will, you can click on to see if St. Kate's has access to the article, either in another library database or in print. You can try these same strategies in other library databases to find empirical research articles. The database interfaces may look different, but they function much like PsycInfo. If the database doesn't have a methodology limiter, you will need to add the words empirical research or other terms to the search box so there, that your results will contain those studies. You will also need to scan the article's abstract or the article itself to ensure that it is an empirical research study. As we wrap up the tutorial, let's go back to the library homepage. And if you need further assistance,
click on the help link. Librarians are research experts and can be contacted in a variety of ways to assist you at any stage of the research process. Good luck with your searching and thanks for watching.